Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to show you how to remove the phone bumper on a Mercedes W203. This one is the C-Class. Uh, I think it's the same from 2001 until 2007. All W203 models which include C180, C200, C320, the diesels. Okay, first what we need to do is you need to go to the passenger side and underneath it right there with a 10 millimeter socket right there there is two bolts one there and one right here in the corner that is missing ours is missing so we need to remove these two bolts with a 10 millimeter socket first okay next right there there is one clip that we need to remove the middle part comes out you can use a screwdriver and then the whole clip comes out then one bolt right there with a 10 millimeter socket and two more up there. We need to take these ones off. We already got them new so we can save you some time and the whole piece came out as you can see. Okay next what we need to do right here <coughs> we need to remove that uh, clip right here ours is missing so we don't need to remove all the the whole fender liner and right here there is a screw this one it's with a torque 20 t20 socket right there so you take this one off and then you need to get a small right there you need to get a screwdriver and go between the fender right there and the bumper and the bracket and kind of pull it and the whole bracket will pull out of there okay let me show you this is the bracket this is holding the bumper to the fender right there and this is where the T20 bolt goes. Okay, now we are on the driver's side, on the left side of the vehicle. And we need to remove the clip again, just like the other one. So we can remove that front bottom piece of the fender liner, right there. Need to remove the three bolts with the 10 millimeter socket again and one clip. And don't forget the two bolts on the bottom, just identical to like on the other side. Okay, next we need to remove that clip right there. So again, we don't need to remove the whole fender liner. Right here there is a bolt with a T20 socket that we need to take off just like on the other side. The same bolt right there, it's kind of hard to get the angle. Okay, right there we took the bolt off. And now with the screwdriver you need to go again between the fender and the bumper there in the bracket. Kind of like you need to play with it right there. Okay, right there. And that's what holds the bumper and the fender together on this side, just like the other side. And now we have <coughs> two more bolts that we need to remove on the top. Right here, with 8 millimeter socket, one is right here and one right there. That's next to the headlight on the inner side. There, that's the bolt right here. Not very long. Okay, we we'll remove this one. Next, on the front, right there in this hole. You have another bolt with 8 mm socket that we need to take off all the way. And there is one identical to this one on this side, right here. Okay, and now we take the, the last bolt off right there. Okay, now you just pull to the front like that. Okay, this side came off, and now the other side the same way. We just need to pull. Again, they tend to be stuck pretty good. Well, I guess too good sometimes. Okay, this is what is holding it right here in the corner. So you might have to just jiggle it a little bit, like go back and forth. And now what we need to do is just remove the wires for the fog lights and the temperature sensor right there. So you need to lift up this one and just pull. This one is the same way right here. And one in the corner right here for the 
I think it's either the dim light or the turn signal, which is burnt, as you can see it's black. This one you need to turn it counterclockwise to take it off. And the, the fog light and this light in this corner as well, and that's how you remove the bumper on Mercedes W203. If you have any questions, please let us know. Thank you guys for watching us. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We upload many videos every week. Thank you for your support.